beloved people of God, I greet you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, our refuge and strength in times of trouble. As we begin the month of April today, month to celebrate and commemorate the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ from the grave. And in the midst of these 14 days of lockdown due to the pandemic disease called coronavirus, I stand as your priest and your friend to assure you and your household that God has the final say over your life. And we should know that this period should avoid us the opportunity to cast all our cares upon Him and fear not because He cares for us. The Word of God says, For the perfect love of Christ, cast out all fear. And this is being revealed to us in Jeremiah chapter. 29 verse 11 that I know the thought I have towards you not of evil but to give you an expected hand Psalm 91 from verse 30 says surely he shall deliver you from the snares of the fowlers from the perilous pestilence he shall cover you with his feathers and under his wing you shall take refuge his truth shall be your shield and buckler. The Lord shall, you shall not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that fly by day, nor of the pestilence that walks in darkness, nor of the destruction that lay waste at noon. Psalm 57 verse 1 says, Be merciful to me, O God. Be merciful to me, for my soul trusts in you. And in the shadow of your wings, I will make my refuge until this calamity has passed by. Romans chapter 8, verse 18 says, For I consider that the suffering of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us. For the heinous expectation of the creation eagerly wait for the revealing of the sons of God. These all reveal to us that God will make us overcomer of this coronavirus. So let us use this period to seek His love, seek His help for our lives and families. On the final note, this month of April will be a month you will indeed shout for joy. The book of Zechariah revealed to us in Zechariah chapter 4, verse 6 to 7, to 7 that who are thou mountain before Zerubbabel, thou shalt turn to what to play. Joshua chapter 6, verse 20 says, when the priest blew the trumpet, the people of Israel shouted for joy, for the wall of Jericho fell before them. So I assured you that in this month of April, we shall shout for joy in the name of Jesus. And every coronavirus will be a thing of the past before us, as mountain before Zerubbabel in the name of Jesus. They shall, they shall fall like the wall of Jericho before the Israelites in the name of Jesus. The resurrection of Jesus Christ rekindled the joy and hope of his disciple and followers. So I decree upon you and your household as we be resisted from going out because of this COVID-19 that God will cause whatever this restriction has taken away from your life or hinder you to achieve to be recovered restored and renewed unto you in this month and beyond as the lord liveth brethren you are destined to shout for joy the lord will bring every opportunity to reality before you after this restriction of 14 days in the name of jesus 
and the Lord will perfect everything that concerns you. It will keep your business. It will keep your family. It will keep your career. It will keep your academics from falling. And you will surely shout for joy at the end of this siege in Jesus' name. God bless you and remain blessed.